In Papers of James Madison, May 27, 1787 to March 3, 1788, James Madison, one of the founding fathers of the United States, meticulously chronicles a crucial period in American history. The documents cover the span from May 27, 1787, to March 3, 1788, capturing the intense debates and negotiations that ultimately led to the drafting and ratification of the United States Constitution. Madison's papers serve as a primary source for understanding the Constitutional Convention of 1787, offering insights into the political climate, the challenges faced by the framers, and the ideas that shaped the foundation of the American government. The analysis of this collection reveals Madison's profound intellect, his commitment to republicanism, and his role as the father of the Constitution. The collection begins with Madison's detailed notes on the deliberations during the Constitutional Convention in Philadelphia. Madison played a pivotal role in shaping the debates, contributing significantly to the drafting of the Constitution. His notes provide a comprehensive account of the discussions, shedding light on the disagreements, compromises, and the intellectual currents that influenced the framers. Through Madison's writings, readers gain a nuanced understanding of the complexities inherent in the creation of a national governing document. Madison's papers underscore the challenges faced by the framers in reconciling divergent interests among the states. The debates over representation, the power of the federal government, and the delicate balance between state and national authority are central themes. Madison's keen observations on these issues reveal his pragmatic approach to problem-solving and his commitment to creating a government that could effectively address the nation's needs while protecting individual liberties. One notable aspect of Madison's papers is the emphasis on the need for a strong federal government. Madison's Federalist leanings are evident as he articulates the weaknesses of the Articles of Confederation, advocating for a more robust central authority. His arguments in favor of a stronger executive and a bicameral legislature reflect his concerns about preventing the tyranny of the majority and ensuring stability in governance. The collection also delves into Madison's thoughts on the separation of powers and checks and balances. Drawing on his study of political philosophy, particularly the works of Montesquieu, Madison articulates the importance of dispersing power among different branches of government. His reflections on the delicate equilibrium required for effective governance demonstrate a deep understanding of political theory and practical governance. Madison's papers extend beyond the Constitutional Convention to the ratification debates. The Federalist Papers, co-authored by Madison, Alexander Hamilton, and John Jay, are included in this collection. These essays, written to persuade the American public to support the Constitution, provide additional insights into Madison's political philosophy. The Federalist Papers remain a cornerstone of American political thought, offering a defense of the Constitution's principles and addressing concerns raised by anti-federalists. In conclusion, Papers of James Madison, May 27, 1787 to March 3, 1788, is a rich and invaluable resource for understanding the intellectual foundations of the United States Constitution. James Madison's writings reveal not only the intricacies of the Constitutional Convention but also the philosophical underpinnings of the American system of government. Through meticulous notes, persuasive essays, and astute observations, Madison emerges as a key architect of the Constitution, contributing significantly to the establishment of an enduring framework for the young nation.